Hey guys, what's up? It's the HG Tech Buzz here today, and I'm making a quick unexpected video. This is going to be a how to. I'm going to tell you guys how to fix the FBI virus that you may have gotten on your computer. Now, this is a virus where a window will pop up on your computer after you're done surfing the internet, or maybe you got onto a website that you shouldn't have got on, and a pop up window will appear, and this window will restrict you from doing anything else on your Windows machine. It will not let you get to any menus, nothing at all. It'll pop up, it'll be it'll say that you've done some things that you shouldn't have done or you have violated, you know, you've downloaded illegal software or just done illegal things on your computer and it'll be like you need to pay this $300 fine within 72 hours, but don't pay that $300. There have been people who've paid the $300. I bet you these guys who made the virus make a living off the people who are stupid enough to pay the $300, do not pay the $300. Now, the way I'm going to show you how to fix it is valid as of May 2013. It doesn't matter what FBI virus you have, what version, because I have noticed in the past that people have tried to go into safe mode and go into command prompt or boot windows in some other way. That did not work for me in my case since I have the newest version of the virus as of May 2013. But I'm going to show you how to fix it. So uh, enough of me rambling. Let's go ahead and start this. Alright, so I'm down at my Windows machine that got infected earlier today that I have fixed already. So if, you have, if the computer's not on right now and you're watching this on something else, go ahead and boot that thing up and get to the white screen, pause the video. But if you're all ready, then just sit back and watch and do what I do. Alright, so... Let's say that the FBI warning is on the screen right now and it's not fixed. Like I said, I can still show you guys how to do this even though I'm not, or my computer's fixed. So go ahead and hit C, Control Alt Delete on your keyboard. Once you do that, it should take you to here. Even though you have that virus on there, that should work for you. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go down here to the lower right hand corner and you're going to want to go and you're going to want to hit restart now you don't even have to do control alt delete you could just hit the power button on your computer hold it in and do a shutdown and you're still going to be able to get to the same place that I'm going to get to and I'm going to show you how to do this but recommend you do this so follow my lead so I'm going to go ahead and hit restart for the purpose of this now while it's restarting I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to keep hitting that F8 key on my keyboard just keep hitting it over and over again and once you do that your computer should beep now once you get to here after hitting that F8 key over and over again you're gonna wanna hit enter on repair your computer so I'm gonna go ahead and hit enter on repair your computer it was the first thing Windows is gonna load your files like I said this should work even though you've got that FBI thing up there and I don't now, if you just did an unsafe shutdown without doing the control alt delete all you're going to have to do is keep hitting that F8 whenever you turn your computer back on, and you should be able to get to that same screen. So, now that we hit that repair computer option, you're now in recovery mode, I guess you could say. So, I'm just going to go ahead and sit, hit select, because since I'm in the U.S. So, if you have a password, you're going to have to type it in. Alright, so once you enter that password, all you're going to have to do from this menu here is go to system restore restore windows to an earlier point in time so go ahead and click those blue letters right there it's gonna load now from here you can go ahead and hit next and from there you're going to have to get a restore point now let's say your computer doesn't have this restore point right here like mine does like I've got a restore point here from just today whenever I fix the computer now what you're gonna want to do is this is the only thing you can do. You have no other choice if this is the kind of virus you had. You're going to have to hit show more restore points and it's going to bring up a lot of older restore points that were made on the computer in earlier points of time. Now most of the time Windows does do this automatically for you. You're going to be like, oh, I didn't even know I had restore points. Well, it looks as if we have a lot of them. But anyway, enough with that. I'm going to choose the most recent one right here and I'm going to go ahead and hit next. And after you do that, it's going to confirm, you're going to have to confirm it. This is just saying you're going to lose all the programs that you've put on the compu computer between now and then. I'm okay with that because we got to get rid of this virus. Just going to hit yes. And we're good. And then it's going to restore your system. It's going to reboot you and you're going to be fine. 
Alright guys, that's it. That's how you fix your computer. If you've got this uh, this FBI virus, do not pay that money. I would not believe who would do something like that. So, by the way, once it's done loading, you can just hit restart your computer and you'll be fine. But anyway, if you liked the video, leave a comment below, leave the thumbs up, and have a nice day. If, you ha if you're having any other troubles, go ahead and email me at the hdtechbuzz at AOL.com. I'll go ahead and try to help you. The email for that's in the description, or just leave a comment below. I read most of the comments. See you guys.